So it was the right tool for a few different reasons. The first one is that it's been tested on multiple sites by the United States Geological Survey, uh, and it's been proven that it can, can simulate natural systems accurately. Uh, so it's been tested on a lot of different sites, uh, and for the USGS, they've got a few sites that they use uh, where they have a lot of information, they have a lot of groundwater monitoring wells, and they'll take all the information from those wells and put it into ModFlow to build a model, and then simulate the natural system. And then they'll compare that natural system to what they actually see out in the field. And based on a modeler's judgment and a few hard and fast rules, they're able to calibrate the model. And so once you have a calibrated model, it basically proves that the, the model is capable of simulating the natural system. Uh, the second component of it is that it can be, it's scalable, so you can use it on small sites with a few hundred cells, or you can use it on a site like East Helena that has several million small cells that are able to simulate the natural system.